It's relatively easy to take a butter or margarine container, cut a square of plastic from it, and using a nail to make a little propeller which really works. A light puff of air and the curved blades make it spin. Now, do you think you could take another piece of plastic, a square, once again cut from the side of a butter or a margarine container, and this time using no nails whatsoever, no pins, and making no holes in it, turn that into some sort of spinning device. Maybe you've done it before. It's really very simple indeed. All you need to do is to bend one side towards you like this, and if it's a stiff plastic, it should stay there, and then turn it over and do the same thing on the opposite corner. Don't touch the other two corners, top and bottom because they are going to form the axle for your spinner. Then you simply hold it between thumb and one of your fingers and you direct the puff of air in that position there. And it should spin. Let's see if it does. One, two, three. And it'll spin as long as you can keep puffing air. You can have fun with this because you can make them different sizes, different shapes, different amount of edge turned over and also see how fast you can make them go. You'll probably find that the smaller they are, the faster they go. Watch this tiny one. Ready, set, go. And it spins like a rocket. Try it with your friends. I want to know. Curiosity.